out with Marine Max in Jacksonville Beach, and this is uh, one of the 270 uh, SDXs we have in stock here. Uh, come by and take a look at this one. It's in the showroom, nice and cool, no reason not to come by. This particular one's powered with the uh, 350 four stroke uh, Mercury on it. And uh, we can take a look at the back seating on here. Look at, we can fit three people wide on the 27 SDX uh, seating backwards here. You've got a ski pole uh, for pulling tubes and skiers and knee boarders. This is super comfortable though. Drink holders right over here where they're supposed to be. As you move forward, you've got a remote for your stereo so you don't have to go back up in the cockpit to change your uh, uh, station that you're listening to. When you're walking on board, you've got a fresh water shower that you can rinse yourself off with, get the sand off of your feet. Another convenient feature with the uh, 27 SDX. If you're pulled starboard side to the dock, Look at the great boarding stuff that you've got right here. If you've got a bum knee a little bit like I do, this makes it real easy for getting on and off the boat and getting onto the dock. So you've got a step there. You've got another step right here uh, with some non-skid on the top of that to keep you from slipping. So again, real easy getting on and off this boat from the starboard side. Of course, more drink holders here. The seating in the 27 SDX is just amazing. Look at all the entertaining room that you've got in this boat. Bench seat on that side. One right here, so you've got a nice conversation area back in the back of the boat. Uh, this particular boat has got the uh, water sports tower on it too. That's got another pull point from the top of it, so that if you want to pull wakeboarders, they like a higher pull point, and this one's got it. So a great boat for wakeboarding with. And uh, speaking of towing somebody, they're going to be able to hear your stereo great with these tower speakers that we've got on this model. When you're pulling somebody, you're supposed to have a spotter to watch them. So look at this great spotting seat that you've got. S sitting here super comfortable. You're not facing forward and then twisting your neck trying to watch it. Your driver's got some seating options. You can have a flip up thigh rise bolster here. So if you like to stand up and drive, you can stand up and drive. I'm six foot three. I've got plenty of clearance underneath the top here. So no worries there. If you, if you want to uh, get to be a longer drive and you want to sit down, you can sit right on top of that thigh rise bolster. You've got a foot rest down there that sits perfect. On your dash here, you have the uh, a Simrad multifunction display that, that's going to have all your engine controls shown right on it so you don't have five, six different gauges up there on the dash. It keeps the dash really clean. Uh, everything up here, even your flush mounted stereo on here, if you can get a shot of that dash on here, it looks really good. Nice, clean installation. On the port side, on the 27 SDX, You've got a very comfortable uh, roomy head compartment with a sink down below and, uh, and storage down there. One of the great features about the, uh, the, the bow riders, uh, the 27 SDX, as far as bow riders go, is how wide this is in the front. Typically your bow riders come to a point up here and you don't have a lot of room in the front. This one's got a ton of room. So plenty of stretch out room for somebody that's tall or if you've got four people that you want to sit up here. You can sit four people. Really roomy. This particular one is equipped with the uh, electric anchor windlass. It's going to make pulling that anchor in really easy for you. This is a loaded up 27 SDX. It's in Green Max in Jacksonville Beach. I'm Grant. Give me a call today.